Hello and welcome to the channel. Uh, today we're going to Emirates Palace Marina. We're going to be starting from there. We're not going to be going to deep sea. Weather doesn't look uh, good, so we're just going to be going between the islands. It's going to be myself and our founder. His name is uh, Mohammed. Because this guy started the uh, Anglers United WhatsApp group. Uh, we're gonna meet him shortly. Right now, I'm making my way to the marina. Um, and after that, I will see you on the water. Take care. Today, we're back in the same spot as the, the, the one we used last time in the last video. Uh, the, nice thing about this place is that we have three channels that I'm meeting coming from the ocean so sometimes you actually get kingfish and cobia we are in about I think 12 11 12 meters uh, depth the conditions look calmer a bit on the side compared to the open sea and I'm gonna be continuing with bottom fishing so the last time we caught big bream from here and you opened inside they had a lot of uh, a lot of shells in there uh, the, mostly the, the bream so we bought a little bit of that um, got the long nose long fish that looks like a needle fish uh, small barracuda uh, squid and shrimp so we're gonna be testing all those and we're gonna see how it works out. Wish me luck. Keep watching, like, share, subscribe, and let's see what happens. So on this one, I'm just using a simple egg sinker with the fish finder. And then I'm putting the... You have the same setup on the, the same set On the end line. Yeah. So on this one, I have three hooks and three different baits. So the top one I'm putting uh, shrimp, squid, and shells. Big experiment. It's the most I'm feeling the pressure. No, don't feel any pressure. <laughs> It really doesn't, it's the least of my concerns if we catch uh, something or not. It's uh, just about, it's about being on the water. Pure garlic smell. First fish of the day. First one of the day. It was getting really annoying. But I invited big boss of Anglers United put him in a swimming pool yeah you hear that yeah because of that sound first one Something about large bodies of water that is so calming. For me, even if I don't catch it, doesn't matter. It's about feeling that breeze. That's a flat head. That's number three. Mm -hmm. I went with this 
throughout the district. As compared to the to the setup they had, it felt like I have a a water gun. <laughs> and they have jet fighters, but I caught a tuna. Oh, okay. Uh, on this one. Oh, that's your. Is that the jigging rod you were using last time? No. The okay. first time I went, I was uh, I wasn't prepared. I, they didn't tell me. <laughs> and by, this one has a max 120 grams jig, and for some reason I thought it's 150. So when I reached there, I told me what's going to be. Well, then I have one well, max 150. And I told me 150. You need a minimum of 200 to to, to reach the bottom. I put the 200 jig on it. Mm -hmm. I was jigging normally, but the fish I caught it was on a 120 gram jig, and the current uh, slowed down a little bit. So that's why it's sinking directly down. Jig, any jig that is symmetrical, 100% symmetrical from both sides, yeah. that's a fast jig. Any jig that is not symmetrical from both sides. So you usually, usually you get one side that is one side is flat. Uh, one side is flat, or it has some sort of uh, We're having a very slow and bad day today. <laughs> yeah, we kind of expected that. Yeah. And there's fish at the bottom, but it's not biting. I have to drive quite a distance from here to the, to the marina. It was a very slow day. Uh, at some point, there were so many boats, and I was wondering whether those people were catching or not. Or they were just enjoying themselves. But compared to other days, today was today was really slow. So we're gonna start packing now. see any beds along the way, stop and do some casting and then go and pick it up. I, when I stopped fishing, I went with my friend to the same landing shot. We copy pasted each one, the same rod, same reel, same line, same everything. One day, you would be fishing next to each other with the same jig, same everything, same bait, everything. One of us would be catching on the other. Yeah, the other one. <laughs> The other time you go, you think, okay, I'm a very good fisherman. I was catching a lot the other day. And you catch nothing. You know, the last time I remembered you, Jaira, can you because when we were, when we were together, yeah. I wasn't getting any hands, I wasn't getting any bites. Okay. You told me it always happens that when you are, when you have some experience and there are people around you who are just looking at you. Yeah. Yeah. So I don't know. <laughs> so the, the last time, last time, was it last week? Last week. Okay. Um, so I'm good with jigging. My friend is good with jigging. And we have the, well, there was a couple who are frequent, uh, frequent customers. Okay. Um, that shot. So uh, a Syrian guy and. Jigging for the first time in the world. The yeah. only people who caught fish were them. <laughs> <laughs> and that was the that the question lady was looking at me all the time. She was like, Are you doing something wrong? What? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we went to Fujera. Jason had four hits. Yeah. Out of four hits, he caught two. Yeah. I had no hits at all. Yeah. Uh, the one that I caught was uh, because of the captain. Yeah, but landing is the difficult part. But I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't yeah. Yeah. And then we came here and we were casting the same place, using the same stuff, and you just know how to fish. And his wife was there. His wife? <laughs> She's the one who said that 
you should teach him how to catch. <laughs> yeah. ah, okay. <laughs> he was doing everything the, the same way. And we always fish together. He always catches. Yeah, yeah, On that good. day, the wife was coming for the first time. And he didn't catch. to the end of the fishing session now and uh, we're just counting our spoils uh, the, the day started very very slow and right at the last minute that's where the action became very exciting over here not a bad day not a bad day <laughs> not, a, not day. a bad day for a bad day <laughs> yeah <laughs> Today was your first experience in, in Abu Dhabi. Huh? Yes, it was. Okay. It was, and it was. It was really fun. Uh, it was. We we chilled. It was not exhausting, although the open sea was in a chaos today. So we went between the island. It was a very relaxing, calming experience. Um, the action at the end of the trip was yeah. The last minute action. Yeah, that really. last minute adrenaline <laughs> rush was the cherry on the top. So, yeah, thank yeah. you very much. It was really uh, a blast. Hmm. Thank you so much. So that was Mohammed, who is the uh, I think I should call you the president of Anglers United. I'm not president of <laughs> <laughs> no, you 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 called everybody. Yeah, now it's, it's probably, almost a hundred now. So probably one day we need to vote for a president. For <laughs> I am the one who brought who us brought together. Everybody together. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right, thanks a lot. So I think let's do it again if you have time. Certainly. Yeah. Most certainly. All, right. All right. Like, subscribe, share, and we'll see you on the next one.